Welcome to my zone online school. My name is teacher Mutsa. Get your education booklet in our daily newspaper, street sales, or at your school every Monday to Thursday for pre-primary up until grade three. The lessons are for listening or watching online. Inside the newspapers, there's an insert of the lesson booklet. Please cut the top of the lesson booklet with a pair of scissors and fold it for ready to use. But there is more. We are also available on our online platforms, MyZone and Zoshi Facebook pages, and in addition, our website, Zoshi Online. to my son online school my name is teacher Mutsa and thank you so much for joining me today our theme this week is my body and before we get into any lessons boys and girls it's very important for us to sanitize so please take your sanitizer and put a little bit on your hand. Then we are ready to sing our special sanitizing song. Sanitize every day so the germs can stay away. Sanitize every day so the germs can stay away. Yay! Good job everyone! Now we are ready. Today's lesson is about... <laughs> Today's lesson is all about the letter N and R. For our first exercise, boys and girls, let's turn to page 19. On page 19, we are dealing with the sound N. Everyone, let's say N. 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 Well done! So, we have three special jobs. The first special job is to trace the sound N. We're going to trace it first on the sound, the letter that we can see, and then on the dotted line. Now there are two of each. We have the big N and we have the small N. And it shows us the direction that we need to go. So I'm going to show you what you need to do for the big letter N. Now we are going to try and do it on in the air first with our finger. So the first thing we do is lift up our finger and we go down. Let's try again down very good so from down we are going to lift our finger again and go to where we started and we say across let's try across very good so now we're going to put them together we have the first part this is one so we go down. We lift up our pencil and we join from where we started and we say across. Then when we are done, we don't lift up our pencil for the third time. We go up. So that is the letter N. Let's try again. Down. Lift up your pencil, 
start here across very good and up that is the capital letter mm. now i want you to take your pencil and i want you to trace on the one that is not dotted you're going to take your pencil very good you're going to start at the top and go down then you're going to connect the two where you started before and go across very good and afterwards you do not lift up your pencil and go up very good now i want you to try the dotted one are you ready everyone me on the board you in your book so you take your pencil and you go down then you lift up your pencil you go to where you started and say across then without lifting up your pencil you need to go up and that is big letter mm. Now let's talk about small letter. Mm. Now small letter does not pass the dotted line. It is small. So it starts at the dotted line and it goes down to the bottom line and up and round. We are going to try it with our finger. So I want you to take your finger and in the air you're going to go down up and round let's try again down up and round very good now let's try with the one that is not dotted we're going to start by going down down up and round very good now i want you to try on the dotted one let's go down up and round and that is our small letter mm. so on our bodies boys and girls we have things that start with mm. the first thing that you can see that is in your booklet is a nose touch your nose very good so this is a nose and you are going to trace the word nose from your booklet i want you to take your pencil you're going to go and start with the mm. so we start with down up and round and remember when you are tracing the other letters take your time you must follow the trace lines nicely and neatly and try hard not to stop then you must also make sure that where the letters are you are not passing the big or dotted lines i am almost done writing the word nose i want you to do the same i am here at my last one last letter and i have the word nose touch your nose very good the next body part that we have are nails everyone has nails we have finger nails and then we also have toe nails so wiggle your fingernails very good and wiggle your toe nails <laughs> so we also have a neck this is called a neck now our neck is very important because it is connected to our head and our body without the neck we would have no bodies at all just be walking people like this <laughs> 
So our neck is important because it is the one that connects our head to our body. So this is the neck. So the body parts that start with N are nose. Touch your nose. Very good. Nails. Wiggle your nails. Very good. And neck. Well done. Now you are going to finish off the exercise by drawing your own nose. And when you are done, please can you color your nose. Take your time and I will see you just now when you are done with your exercise. We'll be back after this advert break. Do you have children in the age range of 5 to 6 years and want to participate in our school booklet program? Please contact us on 81 and we will put you on our distribution list for the attention of pre-primary schools. Topics include family, summer, culture, traditions and houses, transport and communications, occupations, autumn and more. We distribute countrywide in over 7 different languages. For our next exercise, boys and girls, we are going to do something so much fun. Please, can you turn to page 20? On page 20, we are going to do a little bit of art. Yay! Some art. And this time, instead of cutting up anything, we are going to make a collage. Everyone, let's say collage. Collage. Now the collage that we're going to make is going to be with any materials that you have. In this case, you can use sand or rice or cotton, anything that you can find. The aim of this collage is to cover our man. So you are going to need your material, the man and some glue. I am going to show you what I have here. So the first thing I have is my man. There he is. And because I have him so big, I needed a lot of material. So I found some couscous. And then after that, I am going to have my glue. So, the first step that we need to do is to cover an area with glue. So, I'm going to take my print stick and I'm going to cover it with glue. And since you are still young boys and girls, you're going to need some help with your glue. Remember, adults are there to help us. So, if you need a little bit of help, don't be afraid to ask. So I have covered my area with glue and I'm starting with the head. I'm going to close my glue so it doesn't get dry. And then I'm going to take a little bit of my couscous and I'm going to sprinkle it on the head so that it sticks to the glue. There we go. And it's coming out really pretty. Wow. Now, like I said, boys and girls, you can use any materials. You can use sand, you can use rice, you can even use cotton. Just anything that will help stick on the paper. It also needs to be small so that when you do stick it, there is enough glue. The type of glue you can use, you can use the print stick that is easy to handle. I'm almost done with my head and I still have a little bit of couscous in my hand. So I'm going to sprinkle a lot more. So I'm going to just put it there we go. And I'm going to leave it there and spread it out a little bit. Now my head is covered. There it is. So I'm going to continue with my art and I'm going to give you a chance to start on yours. Remember, you need an adult's assistance just in case the materials are too big for you or too small for you. 
take your time make sure that you put the glue all over where you want to stick and i'll see you just now when i'm done with mine and you are done with yours we'll be back after this advert break follow us on my zone facebook active kids to watch your daily lesson and other fun activities with zoe and zoshi Boys and girls, we have now come to the end of our lesson and I had so much fun with you today. I hope you also had fun with me. So now that we are done with our lesson, I want you to remember that anytime you get stuck in the middle of an exercise, please ask for help. Now let us sanitize since we are at the end. Remember boys and girls, this is how we sanitize. We rub inside our hands, around our hands, in between our fingers, and on our wrists. Make sure that your hands are dry before you touch anything else. Now that we have come to the end, it is time to say goodbye. And I want Sashi to join us. Sashi, can you come so we can say goodbye to our friends? Oh, there you are. So Sashi, we want to say goodbye. Are you ready? Wonderful. Let's sing our special goodbye song. Goodbye, goodbye. It's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye. It's time to say goodbye. Bye! Our online school will help you along the way. Find us at www.zoshi.online and download the booklet. Follow us on Facebook to never miss a video. Subscribe to our Zoshi Telegram channel if you want to receive daily updates. Proudly sponsored by Ministry of Education, Arts and Culture, Namibian Community Trust, UNICEF for Every Child, My Zone Online School and Amos Meerkat Syllabus.